In this tutorial, I'll show you an easy way to create Flickr text animation in After Effects. So let's get to it. First, I'm going to create a new composition. It will be a 1920 by 1080, 30 frames per second. Click OK. Then select the type tool up top and type something. Let's go for Flickr. Here I'm using Montreux Black with a size of 200 pixels. I'm going to align the text in the center of the composition using the Align tab. Then I'm going to expand the properties of the text layer. Click the Animate button and select Opacity. Then I'll set Opacity to 0%. Open Range Selector 1. Make sure the time indicator is at the start of the timeline. Create keyframe for Start at 0%. Then open Advanced Settings. Scroll down to the Randomize Order, so enable it. Then you'll get the option for Random Seat and also create keyframe on a random seat at 0. Then let's move to 1 second. I'm going to set start all the way to 100% then random seed to like 25 and here if we preview the animation we will get the, the flicker but if you look closely the letters are sort of fading in slowly if that is the look you want to go for it is completely fine but if you don't want any fade and you want just straight up flickers all you have to do is set smoothness down to 0% and that will give you just the flickers and no more fades so this is the flicker animation here Right, if you want to manipulate the speed and the timing of the animation, all you have to do is to press U on the selected layer to see the keyframes only. And you're going to move the end keyframes either back or forward in time. So if you move them back, the animation will be a lot faster. And alternatively, you could extend the flickers by moving the keyframes forward. Here you can see that will prolong the flickers. Right, here I'll show you one cool thing that will help you enhance the whole flicker animation. So here if we close the settings, then select the flicker text layer, go to edit and select duplicate or press ctrl D as a shortcut. Here I'm going to select the flicker 2, so it's highlighted, open character window and click the, the button that says no fill color and that should swap the fill and stroke colors. Then you click on the stroke color here and choose any color of your choice. I'll set mine to white and also you can change the width of the stroke from here, so mine is set to 1 pixel. And if we preview this, nothing is going to happen because both layers currently have the same animation order. And in order to fix it, we select the flicker text with the stroke, press U on the keyboard to see the keyframes, then place the time indicator to either one of the keyframes so you can see it is at one second, so it is above this uh, keyframe for the random seed. Then click on the word random seed, that'll select both keyframes, you can see they're highlighted, both of them are blue. And then you simply drag the random seed uh, value like up to maybe 50, so something like that. And then if we preview the animation from the beginning, you can see that we're getting this mix of the letters with fill and the stroke, and that enhances the whole flicker animation. And uh, as the finalizing touch, I'll show you how to make this even better with a simple trick. So go up to layer, new adjustment layer, Make sure it is above both text layers, then open effects and presets window and search for glow. So it'll be under stylize, add the glow to the adjustment layer. You can see that adds a slight glow to the letters. And then we're going to select the glow and press Ctrl D to duplicate it. So we have glow 2. For the glow 2, we're going to set radius to 500. Yeah, that'll make the text nice and bright and enhance the whole flicker animation. So if we preview this from the beginning, so here is our complete Flickr text animation done very simple in After Effects. I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.